Social anxiety is a common mental health condition. It involves a strong fear of social situations. People with social anxiety worry about being judged or embarrassed. They may avoid social events entirely. This fear can be very overwhelming. Social anxiety is different from shyness. Shyness is a personality trait. It is not a mental health disorder. Social anxiety is a diagnosable condition. It can significantly impact a person's life. People with social anxiety may experience physical symptoms. These include a racing heart, sweating, and trembling. They may also experience negative thoughts. These thoughts can be very intrusive and difficult to control. It is important to remember that social anxiety is treatable. With the right help and support, people with social anxiety can learn to manage their symptoms and live fulfilling lives. The exact causes of social anxiety are not fully understood. However, several factors are thought to contribute to its development. These include genetics, brain chemistry, and life experiences. Genetics plays a role in social anxiety. Research suggests that people with a family history of anxiety disorders may be more likely to develop social anxiety themselves. This suggests that there may be a genetic predisposition to the condition. Brain chemistry is also thought to be involved in social anxiety. Imbalances in certain neurotransmitters, such as serotonin and dopamine, have been linked to anxiety disorders. These neurotransmitters play a role in regulating mood, emotions, and behavior. Life experiences can also contribute to social anxiety. Traumatic experiences, such as bullying or public humiliation, can lead to the development of social anxiety. Negative social experiences can create a learned fear of social situations. It is important to note that social anxiety is often a complex interplay of these factors. There is no single cause that explains why some people develop social anxiety and others do not. Social anxiety can have a significant impact on a person's life. It can affect their work, school, relationships, and overall quality of life. People with social anxiety may struggle in work or school settings. They may avoid presentations, meetings, or group projects. This avoidance can limit their career opportunities and academic performance. Social anxiety can also make it difficult to form and maintain relationships. People with social anxiety may avoid social gatherings, dates, or even casual conversations. This isolation can lead to feelings of loneliness and depression. The impact of social anxiety can extend beyond the individual. It can also affect family and friends. Loved ones may feel frustrated or helpless when trying to support someone with social anxiety. Practical Tips for Managing Social Anxiety While social anxiety can be debilitating, there are many practical tips and strategies that can help manage symptoms and improve quality of life. One helpful tip is to practice deep breathing exercises. Deep breathing can help calm the nervous system and reduce physical symptoms of anxiety. When feeling anxious, take slow, deep breaths, inhaling through the nose and exhaling through the mouth. Another tip is to challenge negative thoughts. Social anxiety often involves negative self-talk and catastrophic thinking. Challenge these thoughts by asking yourself if they are realistic and if there is another way to view the situation. It can also be helpful to gradually expose yourself to feared social situations. Start with small, manageable steps, such as saying hello to a neighbor or attending a small gathering. Gradually increase the difficulty of social situations as you become more comfortable. Seeking professional help. While self-help strategies can be effective for managing social anxiety, seeking professional help is often necessary, especially for moderate to severe cases. A mental health professional can provide a proper diagnosis and recommend the most appropriate treatment options. Cognitive behavioral therapy, or CBT, is a highly effective therapy for social anxiety. CBT helps individuals identify and change negative thought patterns and behaviors that contribute to their anxiety. It teaches coping skills and helps develop more adaptive ways of thinking and behaving in social situations. Medication can also be helpful in managing social anxiety, especially when combined with therapy. Antidepressants, such as selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, or SSRIs, are commonly prescribed to treat anxiety disorders. These medications can help regulate brain chemistry and reduce anxiety symptoms. Finding hope and support. Living with social anxiety can be challenging, but it is important to remember that you are not alone. There is hope, and with the right support, you can overcome social anxiety and live a fulfilling life. It is essential to practice self-compassion. 
Be kind to yourself and acknowledge that social anxiety is a real condition that is not your fault. Celebrate small victories and focus on your strengths. Connect with others who understand what you are going through. Support groups and online forums can provide a safe and supportive space to share experiences, coping strategies, and encouragement. Remember that recovery is a journey, not a destination. There will be ups and downs along the way. Be patient with yourself and don't be afraid to ask for help when you need it. With the right tools and support, you can overcome social anxiety and live a life filled with meaningful connections and experiences.